hope you will be fine today we will study about inode allocation method now as we know that we have two type of operating system one is command based and the another one is gui based now the inode allocation method it is basically used in unix operating system now in this each file is indexed by an inode and what is inode i node are the special disk block which is created with the help of file system now it depends upon three things one is number of files and number of directories depends on the number of i node in the file system now let us take the pictorial representation of this now in an i node we have following things we have attributes we have we have direct blocks we have single indirect block we have double direct block we have triple indirect block now direct block and single indirect block contains data the single indirect block also contains a pointer that contains data and double indirect or triple indirect block contains pointer two pointer and this pointer contain data now an i node contains following information that is number 1 first it contain attributes inside attributes we have permissions we have time stamp we have ownership detail of a file now second thing we have direct blocks now a number of
direct blocks which contains the pointer to first 12 blocks of the file now the third we have now in this we have a single indirect pointer now a single indirect block or pointer points to an index block if the file cannot be indexed entirely by the direct block then a single pointer will be used now the fourth one is we have a double indirect pointer and this pointer refers to the disk block that is a collection of pointer now at last we have a triple index pointer and that contains a or refer to a collection of pointer in this each of the pointers each of the pointers pointers are separately points to the disk block it means here we have a pointer to pointer and that pointer reflects to the data hope you have understood this one thank you very much